again, I, one of the complaints about appraisers is that we, we're never, never definitive. <laughs> we never say this is the number. Right. <laughs> and, so, and to that end, the answer is no. There, there's, there's not. And just historically speaking, there's almost nothing that you can do to a home that's going to increase its value to the point that it goes to or above the cost. Um, there's obviously some exceptions. I mean, there have been some people that have like remodeled a basement, for example, or, or even built out a basement, and they did the work themselves. And they had friends that had supplies and all that. So their cost was significantly lower than what it would traditionally cost somebody. So, you know, you finish a, a nice basement, it would cost somebody $50,000 if they hired a contractor to do it, but the homeowner did it themselves, they did all the labor, so they didn't have that as a cost. They had extra supplies, that, and it cost them $10,000 to, you know, to put it in right. uh, on their own, they're probably going to get their money, almost certainly without right. question. Uh, but, but you know, traditionally speaking, every improvement that you've done, that you get done, it's never going to add up to what it costs. So the ten thousand dollar kitchen remodel you mentioned, you know, you might get seven, eight, nine thousand dollars out of it, but it's very like, unlikely that you'll get ten. That's not to say that you won't. Uh, Again, there's always the exception to the rule if you have a, a home that was built in the, you know, the 50s or 60s and still has the same kitchen from the 50s or 60s <laughs> right. with the oh, yeah. avocado grade appliances <laughs> and the harvest gold, everything, it looks hideous. Uh, you know, you tear that out and remodel it for, you know, ten, fifteen thousand dollars $15,000, you're probably going to get your money back out of it um, because it was way overdue. Right. But if you have a home that's 10 years old that still has a very good functional kitchen, nothing wrong with that, and, you know, the laminate countertops, you know, the, the cheaper cabinets and things like that, and you go and you put in custom cabinets and granite and all that, you spend some money, you're probably not going to get your money back out of it. I mean, a little bit, but again, not, not anywhere near what you put into it. Yeah, so. I mean, I spend a lot of time, just because, like we talked, I have construction background, I spend a lot of time telling people, if you want it, do it, because you're going to enjoy it. Don't do it just to sell it, like... There's very few times that doing it to sell it is economically a smart decision. Yeah. Unless you're going to enjoy it. Now, like, if you're going to live there for two or three years and enjoy the shit out of those new floors that you put in, then do it. Like, it's yeah, worth yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. Well, and, and to that, I mean, you, you hit on a, on a point that, that uh, this example illustrates everything that we talk about as far as improvements that you make to a home. Think about a pool. And a pool, I mean, being a real estate agent, you know, and everybody just, it's you know, not a running joke, but everybody knows for the most part that you will never get the money back out of a pool. It, it, it's like the, the, the worst thing that you can do to a house is, is, is add a pool. That is hilarious how you said that because we just put a pool in like two years ago. We did too. And <laughs> it was done like, that's what my wife wanted to know. Do you think that we'll get our money out of it? No, I don't. But do I think we have four kids and I don't mm -hmm. want them in the house all day? Yeah, I do. Like, I want them out there playing and they're going to enjoy it. So that money is well spent, in my opinion. That, and that's exactly right. I mean, the, having friends over, having family over, the experiences and all, that's worth a million dollars to me. Right. So I'll put in the money for the pool, not because I'm going to get the money back out of it, uh, uh, but, but because I'm going to enjoy it. And so to that end, almost everything you do to a home kind of follows that same principle. Uh, you know, some things will add more than a pool, but obviously right. the pool is probably the, 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 the extreme example on that side. But a kitchen, bathroom, you might get... 60, 70, 80 percent of your dollar back out of it. So it's not a, a horrible investment on, on an average number, on an average basis.